this is going to sound really confusing, but if you cease to do the things that allow you to do the things that you do, you'll no longer be able to do the things that you do. I told you, super confusing. Look, here's the thing. <laughs> I said thing again. Um, you got here by doing certain activities. You got to this point, this successful point. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to the person that's winning right now. Right, I'm talking to you. You just booked your trip to Jamaica. You just booked your trip to, to Fiji. You're like you're winning. Right? You're about to just take all those pictures on the beach. You are winning. You've been in the gym for the past seven weeks because you are preparing to take your shirt off and you just want to look good. You're winning. Money's coming in. I dare you to stop. I dare you to stop doing the things that got you here. See, what we do as people so often is we forget that something got us to this point. And if you stop doing the thing that got you to this point, guess what? You're going to be in a different point. And it's not going to be where you want to be. Now, here's the only caveat to this. I'm not telling you you have to always be the person to do the things that got you here. But if you're not going to do them, you better be in a position where you can hire someone else to do them. And you better trust that person. And you better be in a position where that person shares your vision. That person sold out. That person is every part of you as much as you are every part of this process. Look, there are certain things that you did that got you here. Certain things that you did that allowed you to book that vacation you're so pumped to go on. Don't forget them. Don't forget them. Don't get lost in the success so much that you no longer have success to get lost in. Stay focused. Stay laser focused. Commit. Commit. So when you're on that beach in two weeks, when you lay down on that beach, look, put a book on. I dare you. I dare you to be the person on the beach that's growing, not just getting a tan. I dare you to be the person in the morning that wakes up and meditates. Yeah, that's why I said, I want you to wake up, I want you to walk out to that beautiful beach and just take 5, 10, 15, 20, 30 minutes just to meditate on life. I dare you to live in appreciation instead of say, hey, look at me, I'm on the beach. Don't show off, don't show out, show up. Show up for the next vacation. The only way that's going to happen is if you don't forget what got you where you are.